Hi everyone, welcome back to Keep Talking and Nobody Explodes. For today's bomb disposal adventure, I have with me the man who fought through traffic to get here. Please welcome Gridlocked. Hi. So Gridlocked, uh, we're going to go right into the needy modules under section four. Rough. But uh, before that, you were mentioning to me a little earlier uh, you have had a bit of experience with this game and had a fascinating way of playing it with your friends. Yeah, a uh, bit, bit of experience is one experience ever, uh, but I played with my friends uh, at just a, a party meetup, uh, and someone pulled out a tablet with the game on it and the rule book that he had printed out at work. And the way we played was those of us who were the experts as a group sat down with the rule book at the kitchen table and the bomb disposal person would go and sit in another room and we'd have walkie-talkies to communicate with each other so we could only communicate through the walkie-talkies and they kind of added this extra element of having to deal with having only one point of contact between one person with the bomb and four other people trying to all communicate different information to it. It was um, hectic. It's a delightful game that can be played in many creative fashions. Uh, for now, the voice chat is really all I have to deal with, but we're going to find ways of making that interesting as time goes on as well. For now, we're going to do... What was this? 4.4 Multitasker. Multitasker. An extra arm would really help here, apparently. Sounds like you're going to be having a lot of those needy modules. Well, five minutes to do six modules. Here we go. Here we go. And I also need to figure out who keeps locking me in here with these. Oh, okay, we've got password lookup, uh, maze, keypad, and... Are you a Simpsons fan by any chance? I know a lot of Simpsons quotes. Okay, I was just wondering. Anyway, um, the maze. The maze. So... For, per the technique I taught you about before, yep. uh, reference circles are two and two. Two and two. Okay, got that. I've Where got, is your red? Uh, red is at A2. Okay, and, and where is I, your target? Uh, no, I'm the white. White is the target. Or, white is my position. So my position is actually E1, and the target is A2. Okay, this is really easy. Uh, okay. So, down one. Down. Left one. Left. Up one. Up. Left till you hit the wall. Left. And then down once you hit the down. wall. Okay, nice. Um, keypads. Backwards N, Euro, AE, Omega. Backwards N, Euro. Okay, so Euro should be first. Okay. Then AE. Okay. Then backwards N. Okay. And then Omega. Got it. Alright. Uh, password lookup in just a moment. After I. Uh, Which needy module are you with... dealing with for the, the person here well, who doesn't know? I'm dealing with three of them. Ooh. Two capacitors and vent gas. So here are my letters for password. L, X, M, Q, S, V. L, X, M, Q, S, V. Okie dokie. What is your second letter? Second letters are G, D, S, J, C, stand by. O. Hey, let's have a look at are there any L-O's. No, are there any M-O's? No. Um, it could be sound is the only S-O word I can find so far. Stand by. S-O-U, yes. And D? D. Got it. Excellent. Two minutes, 16 remaining. Oh, that was it. Only, th only uh, three non-needies. Correct. 
six modules were in total, yes. But having to play with two capacitors and vent gas at the same time is... Well, venting well, prevents explosion. Venting does indeed prevent explosion. Oh, with two minutes 16 remaining, that was actually a personal best. So good job. I think it does help that we did have the maze uh, system kind of work out in advance. Slightly, but I mean, I'm all about teaching new tricks. In that case, the trick is that uh, the reason I gave only two numbers for the reference circles for maze is that every possible permutation of maze that is in the manual has the two reference circles in unique columns. Or rather, every possible maze has both reference circles in unique positions. So by saying 2-2 two, two to indicate that both reference circles were in the same column, second from the left, he was able to find the correct maze rather quickly. Yep. Um, just to add to a question of that, there is only nine possible maze combinations in the version 1 bomb manual. Um, are there ways to get more versions of the maze? Yet? Well, at that point we start talking about mods that have come out for this game and people making essentially their own new modules to play with. Ah, didn't know that was a thing. That's what I'm asking. Well, it's, uh, it's definitely a thing that we're going to be looking at at the very least after we've gone through the game at its most basic. Believe me, the world of mods is a very fun and scary place. It sounds very exciting for someone who's only uh, looked at the base game and then gone, there is only so many permutations that you can get, even on the uh, bomb randomizer. Naturally. As someone who's memorized complex wires, it's definitely a step up. Does that mean I won't have to do complex wires for you? Oh, I'll make sure you get them. And that maybe, uh, maybe an opportunity to do so because our next module our next bomb sorry is called wires wires everywhere oh boy. it's a rat's net it's a rat's nest cut carefully five minutes to do six modules thank you doke let's give this a crack just realized i was holding my breath it's okay i do the same thing on loading screens myself all right, we've got two simple wires, two complex wires, two wire sequences. Um, shall we just do the simple wires to begin with? Because those are the oh, easy ones. First, I'll give you the edge work. Oh, excellent! I have three batteries. Three batteries. How many are double A's? Uh, two of them. So two A's and a D. Yes. Cool. The last digit of the serial number is a five. No vowels. No vowels, and I do not have a parallel port. I do not have any lit indicators of reference either. Okay. That should be all that you That should need. be all I need. Simple wires? Simple wires. How Six many do you got? Six. Okie dokie. Do you have any yellow? Uh, two yellow. One white, no red. Uh, cut the last wire. Good. Other simple wires, again, six. six of them. I have four yellow, two white, no red. Cut the last wire again. Correct. Next is wire sequence. Wire sequence. Yep. Black to B. Black goes to B. So, first occurrence. Yes. Cut if connected to B. Good. Next is black to be again. Second occurrence. Um, second is black to be. Cut if connected to A or C. Nope. So skip that. Skip that. Next is black to A again. Black to A again on the second occurrence. Cut. Third third occurrence. It's third occurrence. Third occurrence. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, skip that. You should only cut it if it goes to B. Right. Then red to A. Red to A. Cut. There we go, I'm getting back into the swing of this. Uh, no, red to A was wrong. On the third occurrence? Oh, that's the fourth occurrence. Should still be cut. No, it's it's the first occurrence of red to A. Oh, silly me, I'm sorry. So, okay, so far we've seen three occurrences of black and one occurrence of red. Yeah, So that's keep right. track of those. 
but we'll keep going. Blue to A now. Blue to A, first occurrence. Skip. Red to C. Red to C, second occurrence. Skip. Okay. Black to B. Black to B, fourth occurrence. Skip. Red to B. Red to B, third occurrence. Skip. Jeez, this is not fair. Red to C. Red to C, fourth occurrence. Cut it. All right. Okay, now there's a second wire sequence, so start over from the beginning. Okay. Blue to B. Blue to B, first occurrence. Cut. Black to C. Black to C, first occurrence. Cut. Black to A. Black to A, second occurrence. Cut. Red to B. Red to B, first occurrence. Skip. Red to C. Red to C, second occurrence. Skip. Red to B. Red to B, third. Skip. Blue to C. Uh, blue to C, second. Cut. Blue to B. Blue to B, third. Cut. Blue to C. Blue to C, fourth. Skip. And we're done. Lastly, complex wires. Uh, Venn diagram from hell, let's go! Alright, we've got a minute. Let's do it fast. Oh, shit. White and star. Well, I just swear. White and star. White and star symbol. Um, and then you got batteries. I think it's cut B. Uh, well, I cut it, so it worked. Um, red light. Yeah, no, I think I'm about to kill you, I'm sorry. It's okay. I just realized, uh, how long it's been since I've looked at the complex wires and I've completely forgotten how to do it. Well, if you can't figure it out in the next six seconds... Cut something and see what happens. Farewell, my friend. Cut a wire. Do it. That was good. Well... As I said, it wouldn't have been fair to you for me to have just tried to solve that myself, but... Obviously, I think I need to reread the complex wires thing really quickly, because I've just gone, star, crap. Naturally. But, uh... In the meantime... Are you prepared to try that one again? Uh, yeah, should be. Just give me one quick second, have a look at the complex wires. Or can you, for the viewers, explain the complex wires a bit more in depth? I'm not sure if you've explained it in one of the other episodes yet or not. Well, it was extremely brief, but... Complex wires is a situation where you see that each wire has four, technically five, potential markers applied to it. Whether it's blue, whether it's red, whether it has a star underneath it, or whether it has a light on above it. Based on those markers, uh, Gridlocked is looking at a Venn diagram, where, depending on which markers apply or not, he's being given an instruction, which is either cut it, don't cut it, cut only if I have more than two batteries, cut only if I have two or more batteries, cut only if my bomb has a parallel port on it, and cut only if I have uh, even digit as the last digit in the serial number. Uh, just... Based on those results, there are 16 possible permutations, and once you've played this game enough, you can basically memorize them. I've just realized where I've gone uh, wrong with that. If it's a star and the LED's off, it's always cut, isn't it? Yes. Because it's, well, rather, if it's a star, the LED's off, and it's white, it's always cut, because... Yes. Today's lesson in complex wires is there are uh, three possible permutations where the answer is always cut them. The first is white with no light and no star, then white with star, then red with star. Under those three circumstances, always cut the wire. And I was looking at a couple instances of that, but... I'm just trying to match up that red with star, see if it's always cut. So there's my red bubble. And then there is my star bubble, and there is no overlap. Thus it is cut. Hmm. I see. I apologize, it's been a while since I've done the... It took me about five or six tries the original time to... for me to work Not out at the all. complex wires properly. Let's try again, shall we? Let's give our audience some action and do it again. And with that in mind, let's try doing the complex wires first. Okay. Alright. Definitely not going to kill work. you a second time. I have, again, three batteries. Yep. 
Last uh, digit is six. Just six, yep. No parallel port. Okay. And All right. no lit indicators then? No lit indicators of relevance. Let's go. Complex wise. Give me the first one. Blue, light, star. Blue with a light and a star. So there's my blue. There's my star. And it has an LED. So, it doesn't have a parallel port, so don't cut it. Okay, then it's red and star, which, based on our lesson, you always, always cut. cut. Then red by itself. No light, no star. Red just on its own. Cut it. Good. Red, light, star. Red, the light, the star. It's my red bubble. It is. It's my light bubble. I'd say cut it. It says cut if you got two more batteries. You got three. Good. Then white star, which per my lesson is cut. Always cut. And that was the last one for that one. Oh, thank god. Then I was second one. Second one. Oh, red by itself. <laughs> which, per per the fact that we cut it last time, we cut it this cut. time. Next is blue light star, which we skipped last time. Then yep. white star, which I cut. Then blue and light. That's not one we've run into yet. We haven't run into blue and white. But no light or star? Uh, blue and light. Oh, light. So if it said white. Oh. So there we go. There's the miscommunication. Such as it is. Um, you don't have a parallel port. Don't cut it. No. Very well. And then blue, light, star. We skip. Then white, no light, no star. That's a cut. Which, per my lesson, is a cut. Is a cut. And we're done. It is good that I have the bomb disposal technician who knows how to uh, to check fact check my work here for this particular module. Again, it's a little uh, it's a little facetious of me, but I don't have much more time for small talk. Let's do the wire sequence. Okay. Red to C. Red to C. First occurrence. Cut. Blue to C. Skip. Red to B. Cut. Blue to A. Cut. Red to B. Skip. Blue to C. Skip. Black to C. Cut. Black to A. Cut. Red, uh, blue to A. Cut. Okay, my lights are off, but I'll tell you, uh, we're on to another sequence, so restart. Okay. Red to C. Cut. Red to C again. Skip. Blue to C. Skip. Red to B. Skip. Red to C. Cut. Black to A. Cut. Black to A again. Cut. Red to B. Cut. Black to B. Cut. Black to B again. Skip. Okay, now Simple Wires is left. Alright. I've got five of them. Okay. Uh, is the last wire black? Doesn't matter. No. Um, if there is exactly one red? No. And more than one yellow? No. Are there any black wires? One black. Okay, cut the first wire. Correct. Next is six wires. Okay. Are there any yellows? One yellow. Is there more than one white? No. Are there any reds? Three, uh, four red. Cut the fourth wire. My good man, we're alive. Hey. 35.70 seconds remaining. Ooh, I'm cutting it close. Well... Two complex wires is nothing to sneeze at, even if you have done it a few times. It's on the edge of my seat. Uh, I assume we had needy modules for that one too? Uh, no, there was no needy modules oh. in that one. Because now we're on to section 5, which is challenging. However, the next one is called computer hacking. Note, venting prevents explosion. Ex explosion. 
Are you wearing your moo for this? <sighs> I left it in the closet. Get your fat man hat? Oh, I should go and get that. Hold on a No. Alright, five minutes, eight modules, one strike. Let's do One this. strike by default. Is what you're saying. Anyway. Rough. Okay. What modules are you first? Or indicators, rather. Side work, as you call it. Right. Uh, well, I only need to tell you that my serial number does not have a vowel in it. Everything else Irrelevant. is... Boy, do I have a lot of gas to vent. So do my Simon, which is flashing yellow. Oh, jeez. And we have one strike by default. Right. Or, no, we don't have any strikes. Oh, okay. No strikes. So flashing yellow... Yes. Green. Oh, sorry, no, no vowel. No vowel. Red. No vowel. Red. Good. Yellow, blue. So, red, yellow. Stand by. Then, yellow, blue, green. Red, yellow, green. Good. Done. Uh, maze. Maze. Go ahead. Four and six. Four and six. Three, four. Okay. Yep. Where are your positions? I I am at C one. Target is at D four. Okay. So down. Down, 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 left, left, up, stand by. So up, up, yep. So that's you've done up twice. Uh, up again, yes. Yep. Left, left, down till you hit the wall. Down to the wall. Right. Stand by. Uh, right. Right again. Right again. One more time. Again. And then north to hit your goal. Good. Next password lookup. V W I J O S in the first column. V W I. J O S. Okay, what is your second? Second is S V C H A N. Okay, let's have a look. Are there any S A words? No. Are there any. Um, there's only one word T. Any J words? No. Any I words? No. W words? Uh, what's do you have? W A T. W A. T E R. E R. That's it. Submit. And we're done. Did venting, one minute fifty four remaining. Did did venting prevent explosion much? Oh boy, did it ever! How how, how many uh, gas vents were there again? Uh. Five. That's a lot of gas. Yes. Homer would be proud. The drinky bird would be overwhelmed. The the drinky bird is not prepared for this game. Man, all that computer hacking was making me thirsty. You want to do a free play? Sure. Your LP. Tell me what you want for your challenge. Oh, I have to pick the challenge, do I? Oh, yes. So, how much time? I honestly don't know. I haven't put a lot of thought into it. Why, why don't we, for, for, for my practice, why don't we go through every one of each standard module? Is that an option that we can set up? Uh, not quite, but I can ah. give the maximum number of modules, which is 11. That seems painful and scary. Well, hmm. we can be a little more forgiving by saying we have a bit more time to do it, say seven minutes. Okay. 11 modules, 7 minutes, 
we'll see how long it takes us to get through them. Uh, how many we can get through, because I can almost guarantee I'm going to kill you on this one. Well, I'll also turn Needy on, since we've been practicing that. That's actually really nice, because that's a load off my shoulders and onto yours. Precisely. In before you get another uh, five gas modules. Well, usually it only sets one needy module, but we'll see what it is. Oh, hey, it's vent gas. So, I've got two buttons. Two I'll give buttons. you the edge work. Thank you. I have one battery. Yep. I have a what vowel kind of battery and is an, it? That might be relevant. A D battery. D. Yep. I have a vowel in the serial number, and the last digit is eight. Okay. No ports. No ports. No indicators of relevance. No indicators of relevance. Okay, well, okay. I do have ports, but I know they don't matter. So Only the parallel port matters, I believe. Right. The button is blue and says press. The other button is blue and says abort. Um, we'll do the abort one first. Okay. So if the button's blue and holds abort, just press and hold the button and tell me what color you get. Yellow. Uh, five in any position on the top. Good. Other one is white... Uh, Blue and says press. Blue and says press. Battery? No. 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 Okay. Um. Hold the button. Holding. White. Uh. One on the timer. Stand by. Good. Uh. Wires. Standard wires, you mean? Yes. Sweet. Simple wires. Simple. Four of them. Okie dokie. Um, is there more than one red wire? No. Uh, is the last wire yellow? No. Is there exactly one blue? Yes. Cut the first wire. Cutting in the dark. That's the first wire. There you go. Okay, now... Morse code. Okay. So I can do that while it's dark. Uh, stand by. This is where I get to uh, to write it down. For the viewers, I've been doing all of my note work there by you go. hand. Dash space. Dot dash dot space. Dot dot space. Okay, that should be enough to get to work out. So that is T R. Ooh, that cannot be right. There is no T word here. Start again with the Morse code. You may have missed something. I'm fairly certain that first character is T. Check again. So that's dash. Oh, space, okay. I'm sorry. I, yep. There is dot t dash dot space. Yep. Yep. I dot, got it. Dot space. Sorry. I thought the column was in alphabetical order. It was not. Uh, try right. three point five point three. Uh, three point five at three two. Correct. Keypad. Keypad. Okey dokey. O so, with line. Yep. Euro. Okay. White star. Question okay. mark. So Euro. O with line. Yep. White star. Question mark. Good. Now, vent some gas. Memory game. Memory game. We're gonna do it twice. Two memory games. Okay. Let's do it. Display. Three. Um, position is three. Is Button two. Is two. Label two. Yep. Display is three. Display is three. First position. Label two. Display is four. Button labeled four. First position. Position. Oh, sorry. Display is four. Display is four. Uh, same as was it the same position that you pressed at stage two, so whatever button is in position one is one. Okay. And then final step. Display is two. Press label two. Good. Now new memory game. Display is one. Display is one. Second position. Label four. Yep. Display is two. Position two. Label three. Yep. Display is one. Label three. Fourth position. 
Yep. Display is four. Position is two. Label one. Yep. Final display. Display is two. Label is three. Good. Simon. Okay. No strikes. And no strikes. Does have a vowel. Does have a vowel. Red. Red. Um, blue. Press Good. blue. Red, yellow. Green. Sorry, blue, blue green. green. Got it. Got it. Red, yellow, green. Uh, blue, green, yellow. Red, yellow, green, green. Uh, blue, green, yellow, yellow. Good. Complex wires. Venn diagram ahoy. Yeah. Fortunately, the first two are easy. Okay. Cut and cut because of the rules. Yep. And this one's also a cut because of the rules. And we're done. Next is password lockup. Okay. Letters. S, G, Z, E, O, A. Second letters. And got a vent gas. Vent gas just tried to trick me. No, do not detonate the bomb. <laughs> Second column is J, F, K, Q, O, B. Okay, let's see. Are there any A, B? Do you have an A, B, O? No, O. Okay. Yeah. 20 seconds. Yeah. Or, uh, yeah. uh, do you have a U? S O U. S O U. Yes, I do. S O U N D is the word. Woo! And we did it. With 6.67 seconds remaining. Yeah. I think I'm your worst technician yet, yeah. or your worst specialist, rather. I'm sorry. Are you kidding? I've I've been I've been with fantastic specialists all the way through, and you are just the latest in a long line of them. Oh, so good on you. You're too kind. You're too kind. Well, what can I say? When you've been through as many explosions as I have, you know how to pick them. With that in mind, thanks for playing with me tonight, Gridlocked. No problem. Thank you for having me. When next time we play Keep Talking and Nobody Explodes, we're only going to see the challenge increase. I do not envy the poor bastard who is up next. <laughs>